The Sandbox Video Podcast is brought to you by SmartShift, the global leader in intelligent automation for SAP transformations. Hello, and welcome to the Sandbox Video Podcast. I'm your host, Joyce Kilhaywick, and today I'm speaking with Camilla Dahlin, the Chief Operating Officer for North America at SNP Group. SNP is the world's leading data transformation company, helping some of the world's largest organizations upgrade and migrate to S4 HANA. In her role as North America's COO, Camilla is responsible for leading growth for North America and accelerating customer transformation projects. Camilla is a recent addition to SNP Group. Prior to joining SNP, she served in executive leadership roles at SAP. She was president at High Deal, and before that, she worked at Ericsson. Camilla Dahlin earned an MBA at the IE Business School in Spain, but before that, she graduated from Boston College, which is actually not too far from where I'm sitting right now. Camilla, welcome. Where do we find you today? Thank you. Thank you for having me. It's a pleasure to be here. I am in Sarasota, Florida, the Mm. sunshine state. Lovely. Uh, You are also the executive leader in North America for SNP Group. And you left another executive leadership position where you served for quite a while. What prompted that move and the decisions that led you to SNP Group? So I'll start by saying I spent about 14 years at SAP, and it was just a phenomenal experience for me. I met customers and partners in various industries and learned a lot from them what transformation looks like um, in their industry. I've also had the pleasure of working for and with a, a group of fantastic leaders and professionals at SAP. And I learned a lot about best practices and um, I have a tremendous amount of respect for them. And I'm grateful for that period in my career. And it has prepared me for what I'm doing now. As you mentioned, SNP is a market leader in data transformation in SAP environments, and they have an impressive list of customers and partners, many of which I've worked with in the past. So I aim to leverage my background in business transformation and help SNP grow in this next chapter. I've been very impressed by the leadership and the direction, the people and the culture of integrity and hard work that I've found at SNP. Mm -hmm. A lot has been written lately about the SAP S4 HANA customer journey, and this seems to be the space that SNP plays in. What are the specific challenges SAP customers face when they make that decision to move to S4 HANA? Yeah, I think some of the things that um, customers have to think about in parallel at the same time as if they move to S4 is what does transformation look like to them? Where is it that they want to be? Where do they want to go? How much time do they have to invest in that? What are the obstacles that they face that are potentially unique to them in their industry? And what skill sets do they have that they can bring to bear? And also importantly is what is their risk profile? Customers have developed lots of customizations over the years in order to be more competitive, but a lot of these customizations are no longer serving them. And so S4 becomes a compelling event for them to redefine their strategy, modernize their infrastructure, and optimize the things they do. Um, an example of this is Coop, the retailer in Europe. We uh, They went all in. They went absolutely all in. They wanted to take advantage of this and uh, update their logistical infrastructure and environment. And they migrated 56 terabytes of data um, over in less than 14 hours of downtime. So that was a big feat. And we're very proud to have helped them along that way. That is extraordinary and actually leads to my next question. SNP Group describes itself as a data transformation company. What does that mean exactly for your customers? What are you helping them to do? Give us some more examples. Yeah, so we focus on data excellence and data excellence means being very deliberate about your data. So data is at the center of customer facing initiatives today in most industries and we help customers be more efficient when it comes to accessing that data, storing the data, migrating the data, integrating the data to create more modern architectures and be more relevant to their internal users as well as their customer community. 
So another important aspect of that is data integrity. When data is coming from disparate systems into a new environment, it's critical to harmonize that data so that it is the same and consistent for whatever that target um, instance is. And we help customers in that regard so that they have support for a data driven decision making. So in an SAP context, this means a digital clean core, a digital clean core that facilitates actionable and insightful data. When we visit your website, there are several key words that surface. For example, and I love these words, Crystal Bridge, the SNP transformation platform, and a unique Bluefield approach. It almost sounds like science fiction, but these describe the ways in which you help customers make their move to S4HANA. Uh, tell us more about what those terms mean specifically. Yeah, absolutely. Let me start by explaining selective data migration. That's really what this is all about. Um, this is the type of migration that enables customers to move to S4HANA with a clean core. So selective data means choosing just the right data that you wanna move into S4 so that it is accessible at the right time. The data that's not required for day-to-day -day decisions and operations can be moved to other accessible, more cost-optimized solutions. Um, and legacy systems that are no longer required can be decommissioned, which frees up resources for other types of initiative. So that's kind of the, the beginning. Bluefield, that's the methodology that we use. It's trademarked, actually, that helps us to deliver a selective data migration project. It allows us to do this in five to nine months versus years that it can take otherwise and with the shortest technical downtime window in the market. We call it blue field to really differentiate from green field and brown field. Crystal Bridge is our transformation platform. It provides trusted automation that helps us accelerate projects and decrease risk. This platform supports massive amounts of SAP data that you heard in my Coop example just recently. Um, and all of these things together have made it possible for us to claim 100% success rate in North America. This is very impressive. Tell us what you're seeing in the market with SAP customers. For example, do you think most of the S4 transformations are behind us? What's the, what's the inside scoop on that? Yeah, I would say right now is definitely a time when that is the main requirement. And those are the types of projects that we're most involved in. That said, we are not focused specifically on a use case. We're focused on the data itself. And so we're continuing to develop new solutions that meet our customers need together with partners as well as alone. And so as our customers businesses evolve, they will go through migrations, um, acquisitions, divestitures, mergers, et cetera, and we will be right there to support them. And this landscape is changing so quickly. As you look ahead at the landscape, what do you see for SNP Group? What is your big vision? So one of the things that I'm focused on right now, which I'm really excited about, and I think my background in that is very relevant, is to evolve and broaden our ecosystem of partners. So we've got a great install base and our data platform strategy and go-to-market approach lends itself very well to have a broader ecosystem of partners that surround the same customers in their data transformation journey. So SmartShift is a great example of that. We can de de develop and deliver, excuse me, integrated solutions for our customers that automate the data migration as well as code remediation. And I know from the past that companies have a greater impact when they work together, and that ultimately leads to more value for our customers. Mm -hmm. you, you just said a mouthful. Thank you so much, Camilla, for all the valuable information, for taking the time to be with us today. Your perspective has really been eye-opening and very insightful for our audience. Enjoy the sunshine. Thanks for being with us today. Thank you for having me. The Sandbox Video Podcast was brought to you by SmartShift the global leader in intelligent automation for SAP transformations.